start in the uh, center towards the back. The first two innings, uh, Tanaka was cruising. In the third inning, he kind of lost it. I'm, I'm just wondering what happened there and uh, overall how you think he did. I thought he battled well. You know, I thought, you know, they, they made pretty good contact with him. He didn't have a lot of strikeouts. So, you know, the fact that he got as deep through their order as he did, you know, I think kind of speaks to his guile a little bit. I, you know, I didn't really think he had his split tonight. Um, you know, but he made some pitches. Um, you know, they hit some, they squared him up a, a handful of times right at some guys. So I thought he battled well and, and made some pitches when he had to, and obviously made the big mistake on the on the uh, split that turned into kind of more like a two seamer, which which it seemed like how his his split was working a little bit tonight. So, you know, considering I thought he battled well, and um, you know, I thought they 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 took some some pretty good at bats against him. Ken on the right. Aaron, just your disappointment with the teams uh, hitting with runners in scoring position and defense. Yeah, I mean, we we played poorly tonight. There's no no other way to explain it, and we need to flush this immediately, you know, because, <clears throat> you know, and, you know, we talked about as a team, we need to get over this in a hurry and come put our best foot forward tomorrow. And, you know, now... You know, stranger things have certainly happened, a lot stranger. And uh, we need to we need to play a, a cleaner game, obviously, if we're going to beat a team like that. But we did not get it done tonight. You just talked about it with the guys yeah. there. Andy on the right. Does a game where, as the way you put it, where your team played as poorly as they did, make it more difficult in your situation for them to bounce back no. that quickly? No, no. No, our guys are studs, and they will, I think they embrace the challenge. Obviously, we got our backs against the wall now, and, and we've had it there in many ways from the adverse situations we've faced all year, and I know these guys will come focused and ready to go tomorrow, and I can't wait to see them go out there and, and, and play our game. Eric in the front. Aaron, how disappointing is it to have this kind of a poor performance on, on this stage? I, I mean, I think I just said it we didn't you know we didn't play well tonight and that's frustrating but in the playoffs you need to get past it you need to you need to flush um what what's already happened in a hurry and because you know tomorrow's too important and is uh cc what's his situation yeah it's i, I we got to see more about it but you know not good with the shoulder wally Aaron, I think the fifth inning, you guys had bases loaded, two outs, and Carnacion coming up. He's been struggling a bit. You, you talked before the game about if you had the right situation, you would send Stanton up. Did you consider using him there? No. No, not, no. Why not? Um, that that wasn't the situation I was considering. Ron, down in the front. players who were out in late in the season have struggled at the plate. Is it a lack of sharpness that you see there or what? Um, well, I, I mean, I, I think Hicks has had really good at-bats in both of his days. Um, you know, Edwin, uh, you know, started out swinging the bat really well in the twin series. You know, has had a few games here where he struggled a little bit. You know, Gary, Gary finally got into one tonight, which was nice to see. So, you know, I mean, if you're asking Russ, I don't know. I feel like they're, you know, good and solid and have played enough and have accumulated and seen enough pitches that, you know, they, they're in a position to, to, to be successful. Joel. Aaron, as this game went along, obviously your team was playing worse. Do mm -hmm. you think your team gave in to the frustration of the moment in this game, and that explains what those last few innings look like? I don't think so. I, you know, I think, you know, I, we we didn't make a couple plays, and, you know, and that's frustrating, obviously, and I think our guys are frustrated over that. But, again, <clears throat> it's imperative that we not dwell on it. 
and we need to we need to get past this and uh and i know our guys will tyler aaron a lot of strikeouts tonight in, in big moments um you guys scored the most runs in the game but you did strike out a lot how hard is it sometimes to execute um when there is swing and miss in your game well i mean <clears throat> i mean that's you know one of the differences right now is these last few games is just you know <clears throat> having opportunities and i feel like we've done a pretty good job you know offensively of, of putting ourselves in position to have that breakthrough inning where we uh, you know if can throw a crooked number up there or or get that big hit to kind of get us rolling you know part of that is they've pitched us tough and and that's part of it um and, and then you know, the other thing is when you have a couple of games, you know, where obviously it's magnified and you don't get a couple hits, you know, that's that's part of it too. But, you know, the strikeouts for us are going to happen. Um, it's a matter of us taking good at-bats. Mark, on your right. Aaron, kind of following on what Tyler just asked, that, that first inning, you have Granky on the ropes, Gary strikes out there, and Granky settles in. Do, do you look back on that and, and think, I mean, that's Gary an gets a hit there, there's a chance Granky's out of the game? Yeah, that's an oppor it's no question. That's an opportunity. But, you know, that's also taking a two-out hit. Chances are you're not going to get a two-out hit. So, um, but, you know, if we're going to break through and have success, you know, we've we've had our chances here these last few days. We've we've got to come up with a with a big hit in a big spot. And also in the fifth inning, Glaber's check swing. Mm -hmm. What was your view on that? Did you did you think he went? I mean, I haven't looked at the replay. I thought he did from the side. Take a few more. We got one down in the middle in the front. Aaron, you go to Adam Ottavino there. Um, he gives off the uh, double to Bregman. What are you seeing from him, and do you foresee maybe his role changing the series? Well, I think it kind of, in a way, changed a little bit. Um, you know, he's been hurt in different cases. You know, you know, he walked the leadoff hitter the other day. Um, you know, obviously gave up the first pitch homer to Springer over in Houston, and then today with two strikes there to Bregman. Um, where I, th I thought he's having a good at bat with him, um, just make makes a two-strike mistake, you know, that uh, slider that looked like it just caught too much of the plate. Um, then he was able to get the ground ball that we're not able to turn over. So, you know, obviously frustrating for him right now, but, you know, it's about execution. So, um, you know, if, that's just, that's been, been the bugaboo in, in some different situations for him. Ken. Aaron, two quick ones. First of all, do you envision a roster move with CC, and do you know who would be to replace him? Uh, we'll talk through that. I, I do think there's a chance of it. We'll, we'll kind of go through that process, and you know, I'll get with C and see where he's at, and um, we'll talk about who that would be. And second of all, now Paxton, his biggest start as a Yankee. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you hope and expect from him tomorrow night? Yeah, um, he's got to go out and. and and pitch well and set the tone for us, um, you know, because we want to get on that plane to Houston now, and, and that starts with Pax. Take one more, Jesse. Sure. So Aaron, what did you see from uh, Ryan Presley in that fifth inning, and how was he able to neutralize you guys? Um, <clears throat> I think we got a couple guys on on him, and, and again put ourselves in position i thought he made some some good pitches mix in both his you know his curveball slider and and threw some good fastballs in situations too so i think he he did a good job of kind of settling in and buckling down because we've had a little bit of success against him in this series and then he made some pitches there to get get out of an inning